beautiful people and welcome back to Wine Chat. My name is Emma and I'm a certified sommelier with a mission to spread wine knowledge and to help you drink better. Tonight is finally the last night of my lockdown. I'm coming off furlough tomorrow, going back to work tomorrow and I'm super excited. So I thought I'd come in here and give a little bit of a review about one of the bigger purchases that I made during my lockdown and that is my beautiful car oven baby. For those of you that work in the wine industry, you probably know how a car oven works, so please feel free to fast forward to my review. For the rest of you, however, I will quickly run through how this bad boy all works. So in here we have a little canister of argon gas. Now argon gas is harmless, it's odorless, and what it does is it creates a layer of protection between the wine and the harmful oxygen. Basically it's going to stop your wine from being oxidized. So this little needle here gets pushed down through the cork into the bottle and it's through this little needle that the wine will be pumped up it will come through here and also through here the argon gas will get pumped into the bottle. This means that you can take a glass out, take out half a bottle and for the next month or so the wine should be fine. And now here watch a little video of me using my caravan the other night. <laughs> I recommend getting a caravan for someone like myself yes absolutely it is a little bit of a pricey purchase I think I paid about 150 pounds and I did have 10% off from a hospitality membership that I have so it's definitely an investment product but often caravan have sales and you can usually get them for a sub 200 pounds this is the model 2 so it is a slightly older model but someone like me I just use it at home I didn't find feel the need to get the most latest version because you can spend a lot of dollars on a caravan if you really really wanted to but is it worth it now I've used it quite a few times already in the last couple of months it's been fantastic I've had some really special bottles at home in which I've just been able to slowly get the wine out without any fear of the wine getting oxidized or turning bad because I would hate to have to throw out any wine at all. So for someone like me that does lots of little tastings and just occasionally likes a glass of wine, it is perfect, but it is quite a pricey little investment. One thing I will say, however, if you are someone that drinks a lot of wine that's under a synthetic cork, a caravan system perhaps may not be for you. Um, it doesn't really work with a synthetic cork. I have tried it several times, um, often when I didn't know that there was a synthetic cork in the bottle. Uh, basically, the cork doesn't close up. It doesn't like heal itself like a natural cork would do. And so the wine is not going to be preserved properly. It will leak. The oxygen will be able to come in. And it's just a waste of everybody's time and money. However, if you do drink wine under screw cap from New World, perhaps New Zealand and Australia, Caravan have now come out with some screw cap accessories, which look super cool. I haven't used them yet, so I'm not sure how well they work, but it's fantastic news because there are a lot of amazing New Zealand, Australian wine under screw cap that can be quite pricey, and this would be a fantastic solution for those. How long does wine last under Coravin? So from my personal experience in the restaurant, I would say perhaps a month to two months tops, depending on the type of wine. I've had certain types of wine and certain producers that don't perhaps last as long, um, but two months would be my max. 
I've seen a few reviews online of people saying up to three months and on the Coravin website, they specifically say, when the Coravin system is used correctly, the wine in the bottle continues to evolve in the same way as if Coravin was never used. So overall, would I recommend the Coravin system? Absolutely, yes, I love it. It's great for me to use in the restaurant. It's great for me to use at home. It's really helpful when I'm doing blind tastings for my sommelier studies, and is really good when I just want a glass every now and then. It's a little bit pricey, but if you're someone like myself that loves to drink a lot of wine, it's definitely worth it. <music> That is all for today. Let me know in the comments below if you have used the Coravin system, if you're a fan, if you're not a fan, and why I would be really interested to hear it. Remember to like this video if you enjoyed it and subscribe for more upcoming wine education. Until next time, guys, remember, drink better, be better.